how do you want me to leave? Please. Please help me. What is this? Freaks me out. Who wouldn't be freaked <laughs> out? <laughs> oh shit. Welcome back everybody to the useless Mr. Mooncha, a horror game show and today as you can see we're going to play a very new game called Welcome to Kowloon. What the F? Ooh, that's spooky. See your popping up doll? Ooh. <laughs> Alright. Uh, this will be a fun game ladies and gentlemen. This will be about an hour long. That's what Steam said. It's pretty new. Uh, it had some great reviews that this is actually a very scary, a very terrifying horror game. So I just want to hop in. I was, ju I, I just want to have some fun with you guys. I hope it's going to scare you. I hope it's going to scare me. If you're new to the channel, leave a like, subscribe, of course. And if you really want to talk to me, there's a link to the uh, to my Discord server. There's another link as well that you should check out. But for right, for right, for right now, ladies and gentlemen, we are going to hop in and we're going to have some fun. Let's go. New game. To be honest, out of the reviews. I don't want to do this. Nope. Nope, nope, nope. There we go. Let's have some fun. Let's scream like a little girl. Let's break some toes. Kowloon Walled City. It's actually a Chinese... Uh, no, I don't know if it's Chinese or Japanese horror game. So I'm going to say Asian horror game. Beneath the misty skies of China lay Kowloon. So it's a Chinese horror game. The most popular city where po uh, poverty and gang violence flourish. Alright, let's do louder. It's about a 15 minutes uh, experience, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, and one of my favorite developers published this, actually. He didn't make it, but he published this. And for BA. However, for a young student, the first and immediate desire is to find cheap housing. Exactly as the game Trang Trung, if I can say that correct. correctly, though. Death. Uh, something about death. It's also a crazy uh, Vietnamese story, I believe. Ah, oh, shit. Look at the camera. Oh, if if N4BA has influence, what awaits him inside the walls? Ah, we don't want to know. We don't want to know. Oh, we have really unlocked an achievement. Welcome to Kowloon. Kowloon? Kowloon? I don't know how you pronounce it. I hope I say it correctly though. Well, if N4BA has a little bit of influence uh, within on this game, or maybe the the way it's, uh, this game is made is. Uh, it's a little bit uh, based on how N4BA makes his game or the, the style he uses. This will be a terrifying game because all of his games were, were just max, just another level. Same as Emeka games. Look at this, it's very beautiful though. It's, the realism is, is insane. All right, can we go here? Prepare to be jump scared. His 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 games always have jump scares. For instance, uh, there was there was one game of him very hyped, and it was called From Darkness. Yeah, that that, uh, that that's still that's still on my mind though. That game. That's fantastic. If I think about, it, I get goosebumps. All right, now focus on this game. So I don't know anything about the game because I really never want to know the story about the about a game because it's similar to. Uh, um, horror movie and their trailers. If you watch the trailer for horror movie, you get spoiled so much of the game. Is it a key? Oh, we can go there. So if you watch a trailer, that's why I never watch a trailer anymore for horror movie. You get spoiled so much that you actually already can guess what the game is about. My window is closed actually, but I still hear people talking. So shut up. All right. Let me have a flashlight maybe. Are we in a? I rented a room in an apartment on the fourth floor. Yeah, it's cheap, probably, and also probably in a bad environment. Something about crim criminals, right? Still want to play Devotion one day. Want to wait until because you can't buy it on Steam anymore because it, it got banned from Steam for certain things that they used in the game that was mocking some of who, which president or which. Uh, Leader, I don't know. I'm not really sure about. It. I don't want to really talk about that kind of stuff anyway. Or you can still play, it, but you have to buy it on their own website. Devotion. Yeah. Hello. 
But uh, yeah, it's always so expensive. Well, for a game, it's 20 dollars, $20, and I hope they're gonna do it on the sale one day. Because I definitely, hello doggy, wanna play that game. Hello doggy. Well, it feels like there's frame drops, but my frame's steady on 90, so that's okay. Too bad about the dog, he must be hungry. What are we gonna do about that? Here we go. Might Night Claw. Puss me. Ew, what a smell! That's actually disgusting. We don't have a flashlight. Hello? I'm gonna put it a bit louder, I think. You know, it's almost max, it's an 80%. Ladies and gentlemen, if you see this in real life, this is not a good sign. This is not a good sign because I always wonder is it to keep something out? Something in? Isn't that a good question? I think we have to go fourth floor, right? So this is the third, and this is the fourth. Don't go higher anyway, right? I I believe if if it's the same as any four BA games, I I know that flash. I know that the flashlight will be. Um, going quicker to the left or to the right than the camera actually so it's in real life you go to the right and then your head follows right it's not that yeah maybe you can do it like this it's it's different than actually that you look you know what i mean so that makes a horror a horror game in my opinion very terrifying and very scary because sometimes you can actually see something but you're not looking at it yet and then you can already see an eye or, or a shoulder maybe and that we just go through it thank you what are we supposed to do here? It's quarter past 12 in the night probably. Not at my place. 5 o'clock. Whose room is this? Is the janitor's room or something like that? Alright. I wanna grab a flashlight. Yeah. I'm gonna do the moon dance again soon. Some of you made did a dance yesterday in my little video. But Excuse me. Of course, Steve is parent of VI. And you call it now the moon dance. You know what the weird thing is as well? It's not a weird thing, but what I like a lot about this game already is that there are so many surroundings and so many sound effects. Like, for instance, um, the people are talking upstairs. It makes it creepier, but I don't know why there's such a blurry part on my side of my screen. It's always with some, some games, not always all games. I left, I put the key in the store, it's outside by the entrance. Are you bloody kidding me? I need to go back. Probably the scare coming. Well, I heard someone crying. Wait, were these boxes here before? They weren't, right? What is happening? I hear... You hear those, 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 those loud thumps as well? Those deep, bassy thumps, like... Hey doggy! You're alive! Are these cables there as well? Did it change? We got some black eyes. Are you possessed? Let me go down. Alright. I don't know what's going on with the, the screen sometimes. I hope it's not... See, see. Did you, did you see? I saw, I was looking at my recording on my left side and I saw someone peeking around the corner. That <laughs> gave me goosebumps, man. What the fuck? Are you there? Ooh. Dude, where the fuck did you go? You go? 
Looks like a small back room. It does, yeah. There's a weird guy peeking around the corner. Is that a letter? Are there any letters in this game? Or is it just really walking being simulated and just having a blast with horror experience and jump scares? I apologize for the sometimes feels like a lag, but it's not really a lag in my frames. Just switch between 9200 and 85, but not lower than that. But it feels like it's staggering sometimes. Yeah, goosebumps, I hear the weird so sound. Like somebody just did this on my uh, on my headset. What the heck? That was weird. Oh, peaceful. Um, where did they leave the key? Next to the entrance, right? I'm not gonna go back to read about it. We can probably click on it. Shit. Shit, I forgot where it is. We probably get a interaction button anyway. This wasn't open before. This appears to be the store that landlady worried about. Oh yeah, yeah, in the store. The key should be around here somewhere. Looks very good though. I just don't know what the, the side... Blurriness is also up and down. I don't know what it is. It's new. Oh, shit! I'm too scared to go there. Can you just give me a key. Ah, oh, shit! There you go. Why? Why did it magically open? There's the key. There's something else here. Oh, bollocks. Can somebody tell me again why we're doing this? Playing these kind of horror games? What the... The actual fuck happened? Let's go into the... Scary apartment. I think we're not even gonna make it upstairs. I'll go there. Alright, now I'm a little bit afraid. To be honest, I'm a little bit on edge. Hey, what the f Fuck you! <laughs> I actually smacked my own, my complete mouse on the desk. Like, buff. <laughs> Let's see if he's here. Alright. Check every room again. Nothing changed. Go up. Yogi there? Yogi! If you actually said that you're in such an area. I hope you at least get some food. Oh. What? Wait, how do I get to... No, we gotta go there. Sorry, I don't have anything to feed you. I know. Said my soul. My soul is for the dark. A scheiße. Ach du scheiße. Why are we doing this? <laughs> oh, I thought there was a face down there. The cables. Well, 
Wait a minute. That's... This is hallway to the apartment, right? We took a detour to hell. Through hell. It was loading, so... Somebody here! Hey, please help me! I'm new to Kowloon. I'm actually scared. Alright, there we go. Into a freaky apartment. Plus, keep for a reason. That's why. Moths. Home sweet home. We're also gonna play that game. We've unlocked an achievement. We're going to the bathroom later. Oh shit. Going here later. We're just gonna do objective by objective. I'm guessing this is the landlady's room. Wait, we're 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 living together with the landlady? Jesus. Door to the balcony is closed. Is she even alive? Just try to be with the plant though. Who's safe here? Be among the plants. Jesus. What a mess. Oh, also very foggy. Foggy, foggy, foggy. Alright, let's go into our room. I guess we have to go to our room, right? Close the door. Start by leaving the stuff on the bed. Can't open this. Why not? Hello, I closed the door. Why is it slowly keep going up? All right, but do the objective anyway. Not more trees, just that we can always keep the door closed. All right, what's next? Don't wait for a hot cup of hot. Wait for a hot cup of tea. Tea, my dear. Like have a cup of tea. Black or with some milk? You tell me. Yeah, where do you start? Hello? Landlady? I want some coffee. Please, I want some coffee. Oh, right, yeah, I want tea, right? Tea. Tea it is. Tea it is. Some muck. Oh. We hit uh, the water cooker. I can't wait for a cup of tea. Yes. The mug is there already. Just grab it, take the cup of tea, and stop complaining. I heard you walking there. I think it's time to go to my room. Yeah, I think so too. Finish your tea first. Yes, of course. Just unlock an achievement. Why the heck would we otherwise go to the freaking ugly kitchen? Oh. What, what? Is that supposed to scare me? <laughs> the, the, the clothes hanging there? Look. I think, I think it was supposed to scare me like this, alright? I'm scared. I won't, I want to go home. The old woman's gone crazy. I haven't even been able to go outside for a long time. Oh shit. Oh no. Oh, what are we ending up in? What a load of crap, but it's worth checking in front of the door, the door just in case. What? What front door? Your door? Gonna annoy you with knocking? Let me in! That just popped on. I've never seen this before though, that I have to go up to take a shit. <laughs> Where the heck is the shower? Wait, is that one? Is it a three in one bathroom, shower, shit house, and a bathtub? Oh no, I'm too, I'm too afraid to check the. Ah, fuck it, let's go. Looks like the landlady has already come home and locked up the apartment. Oh shit. Let me check here first. 
Rangers. She has enough soy sauce. Soy sauce? Soy sauce. Oh shit. Holy fuck boss, did you see it? I couldn't see it properly, but I saw her definitely standing there and she looked oh she looked terrifying. Lady, are you healthy? Don't you dare to go out at night. Oh, we'll see about that. Let's go. Need to find a way out. We need a bolt cutter. What's happening? What is happening, bro? Oh. No, 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 I'm not here. I'm not here. Take my soul, please. Oh, there was no shower. I would like to see how you take a shower, lady. You see that? Your legs on. Oh, shit. I'm playing, I'm playing with her. Jesus. I'm sorry. Oh no. You need to get out. Get a key. We gotta go. You stop taking a shower. Go. Go. The key doesn't fit, ladies and gentlemen. What next? What next? Wait, balcony. Balcony key. By the way. This is a hell of a picture, by the way. It's not based on time anyway, so. Haha, <laughs> thanks for the screenshot. Oh, yeah. We need to get out. Ah, what the fuck? Mm. How did she teleport there? Okay. Alright. Let's keep going. Wait, what am I supposed to do now? Go into the bathroom? Oh? I just don't want to anymore? It did, did gave me an inner scare, ladies and gentlemen. I'm sorry. Just shake hands. Oh, you're still alive? I guess not. Can we please go? How do how do you want me to leave? Please. Please help me. What is this? Fix me out. Who wouldn't be fixed? <laughs> <out? laughs> oh shit. Don't talk about that. Never saw that. We're never gonna talk about it again. It's actually honest one of the scariest shit I had. Well, the biggest scare that I had. I don't want to do this anymore. Can I just hide in here with you? Oh my god. <laughs> if you if you are saying, oh my god, he is sick complaining, what a pussy. Try it yourself, man, without actually knowing that that shit happens. Where's the flashlight? We need a flashlight. 
Wait, that box was downstairs as well. Wasn't that before, right? Oh, my heart is still pounding. Stop it. No, don't stop. Just calm down. Right. Thank you. The pressure, close it. Don't want to see her anymore. Getting into your neighbor's apartment. It's cozy in here. We just unlocked that achievement. Why is it cozy? Because just the freaking candles. I'm on edge. Also, again, uh, for you, Justy, it's uh, <laughs> perfectly. A perfect time to scare though. I said, who wouldn't be scared? Bum! In my face. The gas? Are we dying? Or is it just steam? Things have been weird in the town lately. I feel like I'm in danger here. I have to finish the renovations and move out soon. No! No, 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 no. Why would you finish the renovation? Just get out. And leave. Someone's sitting there. Oh, it's just... With the clothes, though. Something behind it? What is this? Something there, right? I'm not sure. Okay, there we go. Yeah, next room. There we go. No, not allowed. I'm not gonna even gonna try. Okay, I should try it. I tried at least once. Honestly, my my soul left there with that scare. <laughs> leave it, leave it open. Pistons. Why? This is not good. Came from here. <sighs> oh, it's open now. Get something, get out? Oh, to the heck, no. I think I'm supposed to go here. The key. The key to what? I saw him peeking. The game lagged a little bit there because I probably turned around too quickly because of all the flies. It's always have a lot of impact on the frames in every game. Light and these kind of... All these singular... That's now a body hanging there. Why the heck am I playing this? <laughs> oh, no. We don't have a flashlight. I, I need to check this out. Is there a flashlight here? Uh oh, no flashlight. Oh, don't make me scream. Going against the body. Leave it. Someone peeked around the corner. So someone in this is in our neighbor's house. Actually us. <sighs> I hate when things close and open on its own. Is this smart? Oh, flashlight, nice. Thank you. Well, we're probably gonna say thank you, flashlight. I love it. But look at this, how this flashlight looks like. You're going to be sh yeah, shitless. See this following. Ooh. You can really peek around the corner with this. 
Oh no. What is, wait, what is this? Okay, wait, we have an A. Alright, we're gonna write it down. How many letters do we have? I think one, two, three, four, five. The fourth letter is an A. We're gonna write it down. Fourth letter is an A. Alright. You fuck stupid. Stop that! We need to check on every picture then. There's one here as well. Well, the first letter is or an O or a D. Do we know that already? It's an O or a D, so we keep that as an O or a D and we're writing it down. The last letter seems like an X or a Y. Or an U, maybe so. I I am too scared. How can people play these games? Well, I can I play this because I love these games actually. These are true horror games, in my opinion. Look at the flashlight. This is the best flashlight mechanic in there is ever created. I love this. As, as well when we played the prototype with the gun, there was also the body cam camera or body cam game. <sighs> Just a sec, man. <laughs> oh, shite, It's why. Just keep going. We're not talking about it. I said not talking about it. Deep fucking jump scares. My god. Sorry for my own, no, not my own language, but sorry for speaking German or Dutch sometimes when I get scared. Oh, nay, I, I don't want to do this. I don't want to do this anymore. Was there a picture here as well? Okay, some door just opened. Nah, 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 nah. I actually wanted to say I'm gonna take a little break of five minutes. But we ain't gonna do that. We went there. Where's there another picture? We already had that one. I might even know the word. Didn't hear that. Can we pick something up? I wanna. I don't wanna spoil any jump scares. I wished for it and I received. Let's go. <gasps> no. No. It's a D. So we have D E. We have D E. Uh, blank A Y. D K. Or is it the name? Maybe. I'm, I'm honestly, I'm scared. Breathe in, breathe out. Let's go. Okay, so it's a C, so it's DK. Something opened up again. 
Let's check the refrigerator. Are we leaving or are we, are we going towards it? Well, a true horror game go, would go towards it, so there we go. Someone is doing the laundry in the meantime. Can we go here? I feel like something is following me. Did you go here? Yes. I'm quiet because I'm 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 honestly I'm uh, not a not a lot of horror games can do that to me. But that 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 woman coming towards me really put me off the game or got me uh, how do you call it off guard. Okay, I could have spelled it as well, but I wanted to s is what I mean. I didn't want to. Spell miss any jump scares there or any possible creepy moments because this game is so good did you hear that growl i just hate the doors though ah oh, you gotta be shitting me right pick up something standing behind us slowly turn around I'm driving myself crazy here. But anything is possible in this game. Absolutely anything is possible. Still wondering who ran by. No, I know where I need to crowbar for, but I want to check everything. This game is so, so intentionally well made, in my opinion. This is great, man. You don't need. This is ex a perfect example of not having a very or not needing a great or important background story. We just got moved in. There's something creepy there. Deal with it. But the scares, <laughs> God. but the surrounding and the uh, scares combined don't do the trick. If you have just scares and bad surroundings, you have a have actually a bad. You're not a bad game, but it doesn't work like this. And I told you, N4BA always makes his games like this. And I know it's not N4BA because it's actually multiple creators, I believe. But N4BA is one of the... Maybe one of the creators, but he's definitely one of the publishers. So. I don't know what it means to be one of the publishers. But it, it, he has to do something with it anyway. So... Tell me that there are not eyes. Tell me these are not eyes. There we go. Heck am I? Sweating. I'm, I'm, I have sweaty hands. Did you hear the growl again? Coming from my right. Oh, 
there's definitely not a penguin because there's a penguin post. Oh. Wait, wait. We're going first to growl. That's actually interesting. I want to see that. There's nothing here. Just it's very creepy. Okay, let's go. We have to go here. It's getting darker and darker. Holy moly. I think this has a chance to be one of the scariest horror games of two, uh, 2023. I think Abandoned Souls comes close, but this is way better than Abandoned Souls. Might even name it the title like that. Kind of. That's from darkness that happens two times that you turn around and actually a very tall figure standing behind you. What the f No! I hate running! What the fuck? What the fuck? What the fuck? I'm dying! <sighs> yeah, I could barely see where we had to run to. <laughs> Whoa, what the fuck? Why are you doing this to me, gay? <laughs> Why are you doing this to me? Supposed to be me. Is there something changed here? We were supposed to run, I guess. But I couldn't see where I had to go. Wait, it changed. Didn't it? No, it did not. Jesus. To the right. Left. Right. I don't want to turn around. I don't want to turn around. Where did he go? Sir, where did you go? Where is he? He can't have just been disappearing, right? My 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 English is not even proper anymore. There's something on the wall there. Ooh, what a game! There's no way out. It's saying, okay. Can we get to him? Hmm, that scared me. I need a break after this game. <laughs> no, what the fuck! Why? <laughs> oh, why with the spontaneous loud sounds and people running towards us? Please, ma please be over, game. I don't want it to be over because it's it's really good, but I want it to be over because it's so scary. <laughs> yeah. I want more like these games, man. You're too terrified to... Alright, we can make a choice here. Now I'm on the street. All that's left is find a way out of town. So we can go up. Or we can also go down. I, I, my... my, my Mind is attracted towards going, going down. I'm not going back there. Oh, okay. Thank you. Ooh, it's a bit weird that my mind was attracted to go down. I'm out. Fuck it. With all the weird noises. Oh, there's some jump scare coming still.
think we never got out. The whole part of the story. We heard that door going as well. Actually, what makes me want to play Cyberpunk? Exit, and there's the way out. But how? But I need to find something to cut the chains with. Of course, I thought it was really the end, though. There it is. There's something there, but I don't have the money. We can't go there. Game. The game teased us, ladies and gentlemen. I wished, I said something, and it came true. Okay, I hear something there. Let's go towards it, like an American horror movie. Let's go for it. I love this flashlight, man. More horror games should have this kind of flashlight. It makes it so in immersive. It makes it so, so much better in my opinion. Oh, I thought it was a face. I see everywhere face right now. Who doesn't, right? I guess I like to that you can look up and you see the, where the flashlight goes. It works, you know? Going up. I like to go up. Nah, <laughs> my game. Trinity, yeah. I'm Neo, come for me. Trinity, we need your help, bro. Oh no. Of course, red light, why not? That's where it all went wrong. The elevator doesn't work. The generators are out of gas and, and, the, and the starter... Starter lever, lever is broken. All right. We know where that one is. We already saw it in... Uh, now, where do I look? Lever and guess where? I know where the lever is. It's in the uh, vending machine. But where do we find gasoline? Because I haven't found gasoline yet. You have some gasoline for me? There's actually blood on the door. This game can give you an headache. You mu- <laughs> These are so well made. He scares. I, I honestly thought someone was knocking on my wall here. This is nobody's home now. Hmm. Somebody leading us to the gasoline, maybe. What what, what 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 can I do here if I can go here? What is there must be a reason for it. Yes? Somebody has some gas? Oh Am I getting closer? Yep. I knew that we had to go here. Probably that letter's going to say you're never gonna get out. Let me show you something. Look under the rock by the swing set. Right. I'm going here, okay? I don't know why I wanted to go here. Because I, th I think the refrigerator could have given us a clue. On the swing set. That's the tall figure. I think it's also the guy that used, uh, that NB4BA used for two or three of his games. Get a lot, little short horror game of 50 minutes. 
wrong floor or something like that. It was scary as hell, man. That's it said by underneath the swing, right? But then he they um um they draw the jock, uh, jigsaw. Is it called a jigsaw, right? This thing. It must be here underneath the swing set, or I think they mean, yeah, the whip in in Hollandish, Hollandish. I mean in Dutch. He says German, Mr. Moons. Come on, ha ha ha! And now into the red refrigerator. I knew it. I knew the refrigerator had to do something with it. We. I just go here. I want to see what's happening here. Nothing. Let me actually adjust a little bit my cable here. Alright, let's go through this door then. Oh, this might be... Destiny can be... The phone went off right here. Nothing. I'll say there's nothing there and then somebody went by. Sure. You never should say that stuff into the red fridge it said. It's shaking. Someone's breathing behind us. Did you see that pine cloth in the yard? Don't you want to see what's behind it? I don't want to look behind me though. We gotta go back to the yard again. You were busy with the refrigerator, man. supposed to be are we the killer that would be funny right it's a beautiful hideout isn't it well it is sir definitely i was hiding here from all the horror that started happening in my family and indeed the whole city it's good that there is not a single living soul left in kowloon this coin will be useful to you thank you the vending machine Where's the gasoline though? Going back. Going back to the vending machine. Yeah, I know you're breaking all lights everywhere. Will scare me one more time, I guess. And maybe two times. You ready? No way. There we go. There we go. Where did you go? Nice. Yeah, but now we still need benzene, right? Or fuel. I can't remember this. It's bad. My little girl ran away from home. I don't know what's wrong with her. My wife has come out of the bathtub in three days. Everyone around me is so crazy. I don't know what to do. This gas from the pipes, I never noticed it before. 
I think it's all his fault. Help. Are you hallucinating, maybe? Have you been here before? No, we haven't not. Kidding, man. Want to evict us from our neighborhood. Government is hiding the fact that we're dying here. Then leave! Completely lost in where we are. And here is a canister of gasoline. Right there. What's happening, man? I got goosebumps to the max here. Hello? Stay away from me. Expecting him actually to come towards me. Wait, somebody's standing there. What happened? Oh my lord. Where are we supposed to go? I don't know what we have to do anymore. Was it that we went here? No? Oh, we went through the red door, of course. This is where we went. We went upstairs. This is what I recognize again. Nice. <laughs> that guy that, that like was screaming there, he actually made me uh, panic a little bit, though. Oh, man, I hate that. We're getting out. I think we're not getting out. Dude, stay away. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> I said so, stay away. Yeah. Oh, nay, nay, nay. Oh, get away. Yeah, get in, get in, get in. Press any button. I don't want How did we actually end up with an elevator if we just walked into from the front front door? We got out and then. A little bit confusing, in my uh, opinion. <laughs> I, I, <laughs> I think I screamed so loud that my camera froze. My system on my left side. Yeah, I guess I saw my my face cam. I saw like <laughs> standing like this. So that scary moment, you you uh, well, it froze. So I had to uh, cut it out. probably cut it out or not cut it out, but I had to stop my video and then start it over. Not over, but just a new video. Continue. So I think it's the end anyway. I think we died. Why do we still have a flashlight? Why did we go down? Why did we go up? Is there a note somewhere? Um. Yes, can we? Can we go back? No. There's a door here, but I can't open it. Why is that? Old color. That seems lovely. 
Yeah, for what? I haven't seen a chain yet. Bolt cutter? Or for where? Eh? What am I supposed to use the bolt cutter then? <laughs> oh man! There's something that needs to be bolt cut it. Huh? There? Oh, the exit, of course. I thought the generator was for that, though. The generator was just for the, um, for the elevator to go up. Nonsense, actually. Where's that dude? I don't want to talk to him anymore. I'm just going to run towards the end. Ay, 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 ay. What a game. Doggy! What's wrong with your eyes, man? Dude, you got the most scariest dog eyes ever. No. 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 You're a demon. We're not playing around with demon dogs. No, hell no. <laughs> His eyes were like moving. Yes. Oh, this definitely, in my opinion, this is the scariest game that I've played this year. But this is not now. Dude. Thank you for the screenshot. I'm just amazed. I'm, I'm flabbergasted of how good this game is. There's no story, there's just everyone died. We just got we ended up somewhere where we shouldn't have ended up. But I'm flabbergasted of all the mechanics that they use in the horror game. Like this, this is also a lot of people find this creepy, man. Hello? That, that must have hurt. The people hanging. People looking at you. It's like I think. I think these are just all the people that got murdered here. Their, 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 their bodies are going on. Dude, he disappeared. Are oh, you still doing it? Good. That, that's, that's good. See, that's this. What are you praying to, my friend? It's unbelievably scary game. This is very unsettling though. Unsettling? Unsettling? Look at this. It's... My god. And they all look the same except the woman that we joined. The landlady. Landlord. That's scary. Go to our apartment and just sleep. You know, just forget it all that happens. We got out. I think we're not surviving it anyway. Crashing the car or something, I guess. Whoa, that changed. You saw that? It was all an illusion for us. Recently there have been many reports to police from people who have been to Kowloon. They say they have seen a city that probably lives Kowloon Walled City demolished five years ago was one of the worst cities in China yeah that's actually uh, is that true I don't know it's just a game so it can be a story shortly before demolition it had experienced a spike in criminality My, uh, many believe that the government was willing to go terrible lengths to demolish Kowloon <laughs> fuck you yeah 
exit. Fuck you. Well, ladies and gentlemen, I, I, I truly, I truly hope you enjoyed this experience. Let me know. I, let me know if it, it scared you as well. I hope it did because that was the whole purpose. I really just find this fucked up scary, man. Uh, <laughs> uh, yeah, I, I, uh, I put my pants literally. Um, I kicked the wall. Luckily, I was wearing shoes otherwise so I might have broken my t uh, toenail again or my, even my toes itself. It already happened once, almost. I really had a blue toe after a really great scare. When she went towards me, ladies and gentlemen, it, it, it was wow. That, that set the tone of the game. After that, it was just... I couldn't get back to relaxation, you know. She got there and then the game took off like linearly, linear, like puff. Now we're going, we set the tone. Now we're going to be on this scary level. And I think for most of the people, that's actually way too scary. That's why I think the way they set it, set this up, like, not, it's not like games of, of medicine or, um, visage or something like that, because that's a really, that took years to create. I think this, this could also have taken a lot of long time, but it's not in that kind of league of horror games. It's, it's a league on its own. Like you have to figure this with, from darkness, from, uh, abandoned souls um you have some some horror games that are similar to these one that actually always fight of which one is the best horror game of the year but most people say like game only a game like visage medicine um i can't really name any other really terrifying horror games that can actually uh, be the best game like alien isolation was also a long time one of the best well is still considered one of the best horror games ever made um, but that's it's, it's a different topic this in my opinion for this year this is the really the scariest short indie horror game because it's about an hour long we took our time with exploring every corner took we we, we, we stood still a long time so we play a little bit longer than usual but it's actually 50 minutes experience to one hour and i think uh in that category it's the scariest horror game until i play until i i have played on in in 2023 so yeah that's why my that's my opinion um, I like the flashlight, the flashlight mechanic with the darkness around you, with the, the noises, the knocking. It, it, it all works together and that's why it makes such a good game for me. It's my opinion. Let me know what you think, ladies and gentlemen, in the comments. Let me know uh, if you liked this well, as I said before. I want to thank you all for supporting. I want to thank you all for coming back, of course. For the people that are still watching and enjoyed this video and they enjoyed my, my scares and left their asses off. Good on you. Leave subscribe and like, of course, as well. If you want to talk to me more, you can go into my Discord server. Uh, the link is in the description. And if you will go there to, into the description, you see another link as well that you should check out. Because what you can do there is buy a nice hot coffee for me. So that I always have a new game and then have some new energy for the next video, ladies and gentlemen. I want to thank you all. And as I usually say, thank you for watching. I want to see you back in the next video. And yeah, I will see you there. So, I love you all. And bye bye.